If robots are gonna take over one day, I've decided to learn all about them and as much as possible, become friends with them. That's not everyone's choice or perspective, but it's mine. And I have to tell you that if you're into using new tools, artificial intelligence has made our life so interesting and fun as an author. And today I have five tools to share with you and I bet you, you haven't heard of all of them. In other words, if you're using ChatGPT, Claude, and Jasper, and you think you're using AI, well, you are, but you're missing out on so many amazing tools. So if you're looking for cool tools to help you with your author business, well, good news, this video is for you. Hey there, I'm Julie the Book Broad, and this is really me. But if you decide to join our brand new program, the Author Business Accelerator, you could be coached by Julie the Book Bot. That's right. My first AI tool for authors is not one you're gonna expect at all, I bet, but it's for authors who have a book done and you wanna use that content to create a clone of yourself to either create a chat with the author feature, or if you go really deep on training it, like I've trained my bot, you could even have a mentor offering or a coaching offering that is you, but in bot form. There are tons of cloning systems and chat bots that you can use to do this. On our website at Book Launchers, you can chat with our bot and it's built through chatbase.io. The bot I built and trained for Author Business Accelerator, well, I used a program called Delphi. I've got an affiliate relationship with them and I know the founder. So if you do sign up for them, you can use our link so I can get you help if you need it. Booklaunchers.com forward slash Delphi is the link for that and it'll be in the description below. So check this out. It doesn't have video yet, but for now you can call or text Julie the book bot. That is if you are a participant in Author Business Accelerator and you can ask her questions on anything from book ideas to marketing plans and pretty much anything we've talked about here. And she has great answers. <laughs> I'm continuing to train her so she gets better and better. Now I'm gonna give you a quick example so you get a sense. Don't mind the fact that it's literally me talking to me and it sounds weird. <laughs> <laughs> but listen to how smart Julie the Book Bot is. Hi, I'm Julie the Book Bot. How can I help? Hi, I have a book idea about how to get rid of ants naturally from your home. And I'm just wondering if you can help me flush out a hook for it. Hi there. That sounds like a fantastic and very practical book idea. A strong hook is crucial to grab your reader's attention right away. For a book on getting rid of ants naturally, you might want to focus on the unique benefits and immediate solutions your book offers. How about something like this? Discover the simple, natural secrets to a pest-free home. Say goodbye to ants without harmful chemicals. This hook highlights the natural aspect and promises a straightforward solution, which can be very appealing to readers looking for eco-friendly options. What are some specific methods or strategies you plan to include in your book? So she's been trained with my books, YouTube content, presentations, and client-only trainings. So she is, in many ways, better than paying me for my time. Plus, she doesn't get hungry, she doesn't have to pee, she doesn't take time to spend time with her family, and you can talk to her as long as you want and just keep going deeper and deeper to discuss your book, your book idea, and your book marketing plans. So my first author tool today is a cloning system called Delphi, but there are others like chatbase.io that aren't as complex that you will find work for a simple cloning of yourself. So you can clone yourself as an author and apply that in all ways. Author tool two, <laughs> maybe you don't have a book written and you want help with an outline or drafting the book or so much more. Yes, you absolutely can use ChatGPT, but my favorite tool remains one that I have talked about here before, and that is Dibley Create and their AI assistant, Kip. I'll link to the outlining video I did on Dibley Create and I'll put it in the description below because it is a really, really awesome tool. And their content writing assistant has been improving in leaps and bounds lately. I'm really looking forward to the article writer, which may even be available by the time you're watching this video. Dibley Create is a cloud-based system to write your book with or without AI assistance, but their prompt library is full of prompts and tools that will help you well beyond the book. Go ahead and check out that tool at booklaunchers.com forward slash Dibley, or you can get the link below. All right, cool author tool number three. Need a reader magnet created in a hot minute and you don't have time to fuss with design or content creation or hire somebody on Fiverr? Well, look no further than designer.com. While not a replacement for a brilliant book designer, because this one only does PDF, ebook, or magazine style, and it can be a bit frustrating if you're trying to do something specific, but this is a slick system to create something really fast and it looks really good. You can create it in minutes and then spend 10, 20 minutes refining it and 
it's ready to go. So let's say you've got a last minute podcast interview or a talk coming up and you want some sort of a high value freebie to give away to get email addresses. Well, this tool has you covered. Just check this out. They have a lot of tools to make reader magnets, but the one that I like the best is importing from one of my blog posts. So here we go. Let's just walk you through what this looks like. So I'm gonna grab one of my blog posts. I post the link here, give it the topic areas, which I'm gonna choose nonfiction author and digital marketing, and then you can pick a template design. I'm just gonna go for the fastest thing, go bold. Wait a moment, Put, cue the music. Do, 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 do. And voila, here it is. Now, if you wanna make edits, you can do that on the left here and really refine it. And that is where it gets a little finicky, but come on, tell me this doesn't make your jaw drop with how quickly you can produce content from your content with this. And it does also write AI generated eBooks. They're about 50 pages long. They're a bit boring. And I wouldn't necessarily recommend that tool, but you can use it for that as well. And yes, I am also an affiliate for this one because I'm a huge fan. And if you do have issues when you use my affiliate links, then I can always reach out on your behalf and push to get support if you need it. And by the way, I don't ever promote something I'm not using or stand beside or behind. <laughs> this is an awesome tool. So you can check out booklaunchers.com forward slash designer and it's D-E-S-I-G-N-R for the affiliate link putting it down below for you too. All right, cool tool number four, Canva. I mean, I know you're probably going, I already knew about Canva. And yes, Canva is awesome for all the things you already know it for, but it's an AI tool. And have you played with it lately? Let me show you how easily you can make a poster for an event, just as an example. I'm not gonna show you all the steps, and if I'm being really honest with you, I don't tend to design anything because we have really amazing designers on our team that do everything for me, but this is super easy. And if I need something last minute, I do go to Canva. So right here, I'm gonna choose flyer. Then I tell it, okay, I need it for an author book signing. And I grab one that I like, but I can play with the colors and the images and all of those things. And I wanna show you the image creation piece in particular. So let's say I want something with a toy horse and books. I can ask it to create that image for me. Well, it's not exactly what I was looking for, but I like it. And I think it'll look good on this poster. Now I can drop this in and keep on going. I can put my image here, change the text here. And within 10 minutes, I've got something that's really good looking, no designer needed, no time wasted searching for stock images because I just told it what it wanted and it produced it. And you can keep refining it from there or regenerating. Now they also have a print with Canva feature, which is super cool. So now you can order your poster right here. I thought the prices seemed reasonable too, but I haven't actually used the print feature. Have you? If you have, tell me about it in the comments below because I am curious. All right, tool five, cap cut for quick video creation. I'm gonna make a video for you really quick so you can see how this works. I'm just gonna do something really simple to show you how fast we can create some really good looking social media content from this tool for your content marketing. All I need for this particular example is an image of my cover, but you can get way more fancy, way more complex with this if you really want to do that. But for now, I just wanna show you fast and simple. So I log into CapCut, I choose a template. I want something that's gonna work to feature my book. Let's say I was launching or doing a sale or there's something going on that I want to talk about with my book and I just want a video to feature it. Okay, this one's perfect. So I've got my template, I put in my image, drop the image in here. And really, if you haven't used this before, all you have to do is follow the prompts that are popping up on the screen. And it says right here, add my own media. So I find my book cover and put it in there. And you can edit things like the background and also the audio. And you can add text and do other things too. So if I had a launch date or I was trying to say 99 cents, I could put that on there. But again, I'm just doing something simple for speed so you don't fall asleep on me. You're awake, right? Click that like button if you are. <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna export it. And if I wanted, I could upload straight to socials. But here is the finished product, part one, because I'm gonna change the music. Okay, so that music isn't my taste. I wanna show you how quick and easy it is to change that music. So here we go, I pop in here, select the music. All right. So you scroll through and find music that you want. I'm sparing you watching me click on seven or eight different sounds until I find the one that I want. Now click on your video so you get the music track showing. All you have to do is click on that, delete the old track, click and drag the new track, and voila, here we are. Check this video out.
don't have an affiliate link for that one, but they have a free trial. So if you want to play around with it, it's just capcut.com and I'll link to that below as well. All right, I use AI every day and it's so much more than ChatGPT. So what is your favorite AI tool that you're using in your author business and how are you using it? Let's chat about it below. Or if you don't have any that you're using yet, what is the one I shared today that you can't wait to try out? Tell me below and when you comment the day a video is released, you get entered to win some fabulous hashtag no boring book swag and you move one step closer to being one of my oh so valued besties. Now, here's the video I did on Dibley Create as my favorite book outlining tool. And this video right here is the latest from the channel. So click on over and say hi when you do.